The green field and a fight against flooding and invasive plants. The city is showing off results from a $3 million makeover project for Honey Creek. Taylor Lumpkin has a first look at the makeover. Nearly one year ago, Greenfield's Honey Creek, located within Congo Park, looked like this. Now, it's almost unrecognizable. It's a major transformation. In its original state, Honey Creek caused major flooding issues for the city. The Honey Creek was severely degraded and um, plugged with uh, silt from over the years, and that's why water couldn't flow through it very well. When, when it would rain, um, we would have flooding south of here where they had to close the road off. That was the main reason why city officials approved a $3 million restoration project for the creek back in 2019 to reduce flooding in the area. And after starting construction last August, environmental crews were able to do just that. It's just over a mile of stream restoration okay. and stream bank stabilization. There's over six acres of uh, floodplain restoration and uh, wetland restoration. There is 1,800 feet of additional stream channel. The total amount of uh, extra flood storage throughout this project is over 1 million gallons of stormwater. But the project went further. Crews also planted more than 700 trees throughout the area to enhance plant and animal habitats, improve the water quality, added fishing piers and bridges, created a creekside nature trail and more. It's amazing and to be able to walk through it and see all the effort that was taken and how the earth was moved and the water was moved and it's all uh, ecological. For nature, it's almost overwhelming trying to get my head around it. And now it's an area that officials believe will be enjoyed by families for years to come. Reporting in Greenfield, Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4.